structure capacitor grading the one more method of making string efficiency 100% is static shielding or guard ring method so here you, need, you are going to use one ring like uh, which is having the capacitance as c1 c2 c3 as i have shown remember here c1 c2 c3 are not the capacitances of insulators and we have considered the capacitances of insulators as constant like actual case and with that only you are making the voltages equal by adding the capacitances with a ring that is c1 c2 c3 okay remember these notations the mutual capacitance is always c and like that means you are considering the actual case here and adding the capacitors c1 c2 c3 whereas in capacitance grading you are changing the value of capacitance itself for insulator here you are not doing that okay so in this case like uh, you need to design these capacitances c1 c2 c3 such that the current flowing through all the insulators will be equal okay so when they are going to become equal when this icn is equals to icn prime okay so what is this icn prime there i have indicated ic1 prime and ic1 for the capacitance and that is for the top one so ic1 prime is the current flowing through the c1 that is external capacitance that you have added and ic1 is the current flowing through the mutual capacitance when both of them become equal what will happen the current coming from the insulator to that is mc that is through which the i2 is flowing will be equals to current i1 right yeah that will happen only when icn is equals to icn prime so this is the target here okay and for making that how you are going to choose the value of the capacitance through the guard ring that is c1 c2 c3 like this this is the formula so cn is equals to nc divided by k minus n okay so where there the n is that particular capacitance which you are finding out so if it is 1 if n equals to 1 that means it is uh, far from the conductor and if it is 3 it is near to the conductor and what is this k value ha huh? tell me the k is the total number of units that is the total number of insulator that you have considered so here it will be 4 okay so that will be fixed the k is fixed but n is going to vary based upon the capacitance which you are going to find out that means if it is c1 n will be 1 and k will be 4 for any case so even if it is c2 k will be 4 and n will be 2 okay that's it